Here we go, Tubers. This is the box we've been waiting for. Can you guess what it is? Here we go. Look what we got here. Here it is. MTAE by Red Cat. Yeah, buddy. And this, uh, or axle looks a little kajijied, but, uh, a little beat up, messed up, but I see he sent me new ones. Yeah, buddy. I have a kit for this already. But he sent me these. Right, because these are, this one's stripped out. But I already have even longer ones for it. Wheel extensions. Yeah, buddy. Well, my wheel extensions fit way too sloppy on there. I don't like that. But the ones that he sent me fit perfectly on here, so that's what I'm going to use. So Piz came with these clips. And mine had O-rings that hold go over the hole for the pin. So I'm gonna use the O-rings because I don't have a tool for those clips. But it'll work just fine. The tires are on, she's all ready to go. I got my I hooked up the controller to the the old controller to the Maximus. Hooked up to it. I got it from eBay. I offered them a little less money. To send it without the controller, because I already had one. I had an extra one. Yeah, buddy. I noticed that these batteries are a little too wide for the battery compartment. They wouldn't fit. But I had two other ones that are 5000 MAH 30C. So I got them in there with my Dean's adapters, because I got to change the connectors on these suckers. But for now, I got my adapters on there, so we can take it for a first bash run. Hey tubers, yeah my benches are a mess from all the working I've been doing on it lately. I just got back from the first run of the uh, MT-80. <laughs> it came with Dean's connectors on there and I just wanted to take it off for a quick run so I got these adapters that I use for charging my batteries on my balance board so I figured I could use those you know to connect to the, the car to use my batteries. Well this is what happens. Look at that. <laughs> the wire melted right off of it. I'm lucky my battery didn't explode. Yep, so I gotta change those Deans for XC60 connectors. Oh boy, this thing's a wheeling machine. What a beast. I think the person who owns before me didn't know how to screw uh, the, the, the wheel nuts on because they were both stripped, but it looked like he wasn't pushing the wheels all the way on. That's why the the threads were getting stripped off. Because they are kind of tight to get on there. But he, he sent me new ex wheel extensions to replace the two stripped ones. And they were a little bit wider than the stock ones, so I put them in the back. So the back wheels got a little wider stance. What a beast. So I got it after dinner, I'm going to change out those Dean's connectors for XC60s. I'll show you the pack that I use. Oh. These are the packs I put in there. Hang on a second, I need two hands. That was a good spot. These are the babies. I made these little cushion thingies out of a package just to protect the batteries. But these are the only ones that will fit. I'm not sure if the ones in my Maximus will fit in here or not. But these are the ones. Sorry, I need a camera stand or something. But these are 5000 MAH 40C. These are good batteries. And it melted that wire right into pieces. Yeah, buddy, this thing is a beast. 
Look at the size of the can in that sucker, huh? That's a Coke can for you. They, they come stock with the Savix. Uh, what do you call that? Servo? Yep. I'm going mind blank for a second. But this thing's a wheelie machine, man. I think it needs a couple tooth bigger on the pinion. And I do have some pinion, a pinion set coming. And it probably wouldn't hurt to put a fan on the motor. The motor got a little warm during that run. Wouldn't hurt to have a fan on there. Yeah, buddy. The MT80 4S. What a beast. Y'all stay confident but humble. Peace.